Dead pilot. Okay. He was dead. Smash. No, 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 no. Go away. Go away. Mother. Yes. <clears throat> oh, no. What was that? They're everywhere. You took care of yourself, didn't you? Move. Oof. Oh God. What was happening? They attacked the motel. They attacked the motel. Some stickers in a drawer, and I put them on my walkie. Hey, sweet pea. That's neat. I'll find you in a minute. Hmm. Looks like we got the kid on watch again. What'd you get? We might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone. Come and rape our women and children. Uh, a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. We're fine, by the way. Nice work. This will keep us going. If we carry on like this, we'll get through the winter here. The winter? We'll freeze our asses off here. Because piling into an RV with you after what you did to my dad is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know, I'll do what it um, takes to keep everyone safe. We're all this place is fine. This place is fine, Kitty. That's not what you've been saying. I know we gotta go eventually. At it again, are we? Can it, Carly? Don't boss people around. Um. I'm sorry. Somebody needs to make executive decisions for the group, though. And I don't think you're capable anymore. And don't start with me, either. Ken, we're all losing it with the attacks and lack of food. What about the food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's gotta be thinking about this shit. How has this not been working? Um, we, we got all the protection now. Because Lee knows how to take care of people, not just things. We deal with shit as it comes, just like we always do. And when 15 bandits hop over that wall in the middle of the night, what then? You just gonna deal with that? Everything that happens to us is another excuse for you to pull this crap about leaving. All I want is a week of peace, of not hearing it. Wouldn't even be fighting about our medicine and supply stocks if Lee hadn't fucked up downtown. What do you mean? Some girl came screaming out of an alley. She had dead hanging all over her. She was making enough noise that we would have had plenty of time to get what we needed. Instead, smart guy shot her. He what? He put her out of her misery. It was a mistake. It was a mistake. You bet your ass it was. Y'all should be giving Lee hell for not doing what needed to be done. It's not so easy for him. Look, oh no. Macon and its people aren't savable. It's not a town. It's full of walkers. And the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. It's hell on earth. And it's coming this way. Yes. It's not going to be easier out on the road. How would you know? What I know? I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies. That's right. Stealing. And I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day. Now everybody get out! What the hell? Um... She'll get over it. She's riling everybody up otherwise. You understand, Ken. All I know is, whenever this shit happens, I'm the fucking bad guy. I'd like a thank you for once. For once! Oh. Things are coming to 
to a head. You can say that. Well, I think you did good today. And I find myself thinking that most days. Thanks. It's probably worth following up with Lily about what she was saying about missing supplies. With her wound up the way she is, I don't want to see her paranoid. No question. And I'd like to talk when you've got a minute. Yeah, of course. we got a minute. Or two. No, we're alone. Come on. Let's climb the stairs. She wants to talk with us. What I wanted to say was, I've been thinking a lot about you. I think about you too. Our group is small. You're small. What? <laughs> what? You're a convicted killer. Carly, Jesus. And I think people should know. Not because they deserve to, and not because you're a bad man. I think the opposite of those two things. People need to know because we're hanging by a thread here, and I can't see Lily talk about you without thinking it's the next thing she's going to say. You don't have to tell everyone, but think about who you trust and take the opportunity while you have it. Um, it's a lifetime ago, you're prob- no, probably she's right. Of course I'm probably right. People might yeah. be pissed. And telling them might cause some trouble, but it will be a far cry from what will happen if they don't hear it from you. Yeah. So you'll do it then? Um, yeah. I'll let people we need to talk, talk about, about, about that. Good. I think it's for the best. Don't call me small. Cute. Is there anything else you want to talk about? Um, do you think people are ready to hear about me? Do you feel safe here? Do you have any thoughts about Lily? Yeah. Do you feel safe here? Show me a bath with a heated floor and a high-rise apartment and hand me a full-bodied Malbec and then I'll feel safe. I don't know, this place is fine, but we all know that that could change at any second. Uh, do you have any thoughts about Lily? Uh, have any thoughts about Lily? worry about her, that's about it. She keeps trying to run things, but it's just not working. You really think people are ready to hear about me? It's not a matter of ready or not. There's never going to be a good time, but there are going to be a lot of bad ones. Right now it doesn't seem like one of them. Okay. But everyone's different. Who knows how each person would take it, you know? Maybe it's worth thinking about who you want to tell. I'm going to look into this thing. Good idea. Okay, we need to talk about that. We need. To Clementine. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. What you doing, What's dear? What's that you working on, Clem? It's called a leaf rubbing. My teacher, Miss Moore, showed us how to do them when we went to the botanical garden once. Great. See, it's the same. Um, kind of. Ah, that's really something. I'll make one for you, too. Do you like it there? Like I don't like it here. Do you want to be? Where are we going? Somewhere else. I don't know. Maybe if I knew where? Yeah. That'd be a good thing to know. Um, no. Talk that doesn't later. tell it to Clementine. Okay. That's better. Hey, you too. Talk to, How you doing? to Kenny. We're okay. Just having a little spat. We all carry guns now, and I don't like it. It's the way it's gotta be. I know, but I'm not getting used to it. I'm sorry. How are you, Lee? Uh. Kenny, you got a second? I need to tell you something. Yeah? What do you got? Okay, first to Kenny. Uh, 